We're here at BuyInsulationProducts.com to discuss how to prevent a pipe from freezing in the winter. One of the ways to do so is to add an additional heat source such as a pipe heating cable. A water pipe with a pipe heating cable can withstand temperatures as low as minus 50 degrees. At BuyInsulationProducts.com we sell pipe heating cables as short as 3 feet and as long as 100 feet. This instructional video will show you how to properly install this heating cable. Here we have a pipe heating cable from BuyInsulationProducts.com. Each pipe heating cable will come with an automatic thermostat which turns the pipe heating cable on or off when necessary. It has a power light that tells you if the power is on or off and it also has a test button which lets you know if the heating cable is working properly. Now we're going to show you how to properly install this heating cable on this pipe. One thing to remember when installing a pipe heating cable is that the thermostat has to be left outside of the pipe insulation. So for this mock-up we're going to be heat treating this piece of the pipe and putting a piece of pipe covering here. So let's put the thermostat outside of that area. You can attach the thermostat with regular electrical tape and we'll tape that on the pipe. Okay, now wrap the pipe around with the heating cable. One tip is never cross the lines, that's a mistake. Another tip is a lot of these pipes freeze at the elbow, so do not skip over the elbow, rather always make sure that it's being touched by part of the heating cable. Use the same electrical tape to tape the tail on. At this point you can plug in the heating cable to make sure that it works. The thermostat will light up showing that it's working. You can press the test button as well. Now that we've properly installed the pipe heating cable, we need to add one inch thick fiberglass pipe covering to this line. By adding pipe insulation, it allows the pipe heating cable to heat the water inside the pipe rather than the air around. Keep in mind when insulating, this is a one inch iron pipe, a piece of one by one will not fit because of the larger diameter the pipe heating cable creates. You would have to go up one pipe size to inch and a quarter, so always step up your pipe insulation one size when you're using a pipe heating cable. Here you can see the inch and a quarter by one closes properly, not allowing any heat to escape. Once this is properly insulated, this thermostat will kick off as much as possible and it'll save you energy in the long run. Visit us at buyinsulationproductstore.com for more information on pipe heating cables and for more instructional videos.